Hello everyone, this is Ms. Nu Trang again. Welcome to the next lesson about how to use Hot Potatoes program to make quizzes in English language teaching. Now let's think in about one minute and answer this question. What are some benefits of using quizzes in English language teaching? Have you figured out the answers? Well, quick quizzes throughout the day can help teachers assess the effectiveness of their instruction, as well as student understanding of the concepts taught. When you use quizzes, you can motivate learners to learn and practice more, help learners remember longer, assess what was learned, develop English language knowledge and skills, provide aid in the team building process, and surely, quizzes can be funny but competitive. Nowadays, more and more teachers are feeling increased pressure to accurately assess their students' academic progress while, at the same time, assessing and improving their own competence in the classroom. So, how can teachers assess student learning and evaluate the quality of their own teaching, without losing the interest of their students? The answer is simple, implement quick quizzes throughout daily instruction to ensure that students understand what you're teaching and when they don't to understand where your teaching has missed the mark. Then, what are some benefits of using online quizzes in English language teaching? You know, students benefit greatly from being able to take online practice quizzes. These quizzes focus on the critical lower level thinking learning for the students. The students can practice these activities on online quizzes, therefore, freeing up class time for higher level thinking activities. Here are some of the advantages of using online quizzes as formative assessment. Computer literacy Timely feedback Self-pacing Variety Individualized learning Availability and autonomy Students do not have to wonder if their answer is correct or not as they answer a question, the quiz programs tells the student. Students get immediate reaction to their answer, they do not have to wait until the next class which may be 24 hours, 48 hours, or more away. The online quiz program focuses on parts of the learning goal details that students might have overlooked. Students can read the teacher provided strategy for improvement for each wrong answer. The students do not just know that they are incorrect but they see an explanation of how to improve. They learn how to do it right, they improve through formative assessment. Students can begin to use their new strategy as they encounter a problem using the same concept that they just missed. They can verify if they are applying the strategy correctly. Students can answer without feeling badly about having a wrong answer as can happen in a class. No other student knows. Students can retake a practice quiz as often as they want to improve their score. The program can be set to keep the highest score. If the practice quizzes are truly formative, then no grade will be taken. Students will demonstrate their learning in class and on summative tests. Teachers can quickly analyze in what areas students are successful and in what areas they have demonstrated learning gaps. They can select an appropriate learning strategy for each student per class. The teachers can use the online quizzes graphing analysis to see if any learning gaps are class-wide. Such real-time data improves the formative assessment process. Teachers do not lose time in going around the classroom physically checking in homework. Therefore. Teachers have more time in class to help students improve and to work on higher level skills. Likewise, if teachers do go around the room checking in homework, they do not have the time to check each individual answer of each student. If students do 25 questions, the teachers can only glance over the homework. The teachers probably do not have time to explain individually to each student which answers are incorrect and what strategy will work for each incorrect answer. Both students and teachers can see the students' progress over time as they see the online quiz scores. In addition, teachers may notice patterns such as Tom does well on vocabulary quizzes but has trouble on grammar quizzes, teachers can then determine how to help Tom with his general learning problem of grammar. Some common types of questions included in quizzes are True slash false slash not given Short answer Gap filling Crossword matching, reordering, 
multiple choice with one correct answer or multi-select and hybrid questions now if you want to make quizzes online you can go to http colon slash slash www.quizlet.com and give it a try here is the front page of the site and a quick tour through different aspects of the site
If you want to create quizzes offline and upload them online later, you can use Hot Potatoes program. The address of the site is https slash slash hotpot.uvic.ca slash and you can easily download the latest version of the program onto your computer for installation. There are five main types of quizzes in Hot Potatoes, including J-Close, J-Match, J-Quiz, J-Cross, and J-Mix. Each of them can help you create a different kind of quiz or exercise for students' practice or assessment. Please have a look at the videos in the section Reference Videos under this section of Lecture Video to learn more about how to use Hot Potatoes to make quizzes. Remember. The most important goal in assessing your teaching with a quiz is to think about how students are learning and associate that with an evaluation of your instruction. When you do that, you help your students and improve your pedagogy simultaneously. Goodbye for now. And see you in the next episode.